First, we want to bring you to some breaking news that's going on right now in Middlebury, where we are told that police are in the middle of an hours-long standoff with a person inside of a home right on Porter Avenue. Let's get right out to Channel 3 Eyewitnesses reporter Olivia Schuler with the late-breaking update. Olivia, what's changed? Wendell, good morning. Well, there are still a few police cruisers blocking off the area of Porter Avenue here. We know that there is some type of standoff going on right now with police and a person that lives down this road. You can see right now a better shot of what we're seeing, and I'll tell you in the last several minutes, we have seen a lot of movement in this area. We've seen police cruisers leave. We've seen Connecticut State Police cruisers leave as well. Uh, as well as some SWAT vehicles in this area. Now, this is going on about 12 hours. This started last night. We do not know who police are looking to get a hold of this morning. We also don't know why this person has barricaded themselves in their home. In this area, we have heard several loud pops, but not gunshots. We know it was a very serious situation, very fluid, because neighbors in this area had been evacuated from their home, forced to find somewhere else to sleep. Now, in the last couple minutes, we do know that police did allow some residents to return to their home here. Now, one man we spoke to says in seconds, police Police officers swarmed this area overnight with guns drawn. Police are not sharing with them any information. They're, they're very surprised, very shocked, and the, the biggest thing would probably be is the unknown. What's happening? Why? Um, so that's the biggest question we, we all have to ask each other or ourselves. Now at this time, we know Porter Avenue is shut down by police officers. We also know that Steinman Avenue is being blocked off by some police cruisers as well. So just for people that are driving around this area to be aware of that, once again, the residents are allowed back within this area. We're live this morning in Middlebury, Olivia Schuler, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. 33.